All right, 7 Eyewitness News at 11. You know, it's something that high school students wait for all year long. Prom. But oftentimes, teenagers who are battling cancer can't attend their school's dance because of their difficult fight. And that's where Roswell Park is stepping in, treating these teens to a night they'll never forget. Music, dancing, and dining while dressed to the nines. Welcome to the Moonlight Masquerade. It's crazy for everyone to have this. I'm not used to wearing a suit, so I mean, that's a new experience right there. For more than 50 local teen cancer survivors, patients, and their guests, it was a carefree chance to party the night away at the third annual Teens Living with Cancer prom. Some of them actually aren't able to make it to their own prom, so this gives them that prom, and it gives them experience with their friends, and just allows them to go out and be teens and have the best night of their life. Really nice. It just, when you're in the hospital, it's all like cooped up and sad and not fun. But when you can like enjoy everything else, it's good. <laughs> every year, this is my third one, this is my last one, and every year it just looks like I'm healthier and healthier. It's great. Among the special guests, members of the Clarence High School football team who acted as escorts for the event. They just jump out on the dance floor, they grab a girl by the hand, and they um, they just have a good time. And that's something organizers say goes a long way. This is a night out where they get to be with friends and hang out and not have to worry about you know anything having to do with cancer. Just a great event tonight, and boy, they got some great weather for it as well. They Aaron. certainly did. Nice to see all the smiles yes. enjoying the prom yes. tonight. And uh, a lot of you were smiling with that forecast this evening. As